Hello everyone, I am Ravi Kumar Nethi, Senior Staff Engineer with Qualcomm. In this video, we are going to give a short demo of object detection using live camera preview. In the current solution, we used a model called MobileNet SSD and the paper for this is MobileNet V2 Inverted Residuals and Linear Bottlenecks. The source for the paper and the model architecture and comparison of this model with respect to YOLO model are shown in the figure. This model is converted and optimized using Qualcomm Neural Processing SDK for Artificial Intelligence. For the current demo, a cafe version of MobileNet SSD was used. How to download the model and the proto text file of the model are given on the screen. The command to convert model to DLC is also given on the screen. If a user wants to change the model with another object detection model, they can very well do so, but they need to keep the following points in mind. We need to ensure that the Qualcomm Neural Processing SDK for A supports the operations in the selected model. And the user need to study the pre-processing and post-processing requirements for the model they did select. Also, most object detection models operate in RGB color space. Camera normally inputs YGV buffers and they need to be converted to RGB space based on the model requirements. This conversion is not same for every model. This slide details how to package the converted DLC into an Android application as a solution. In the demo application, we need to give permission in Android XML file for the APK to capture camera frames. Then we need to load the model and start capturing the preview frames. We also need to convert the captured camera preview frames from YGB to RGB color space and give it to the model as an input. The output from the model should be used to draw bounding boxes as rectangles on the detected regions of interest. Along with it, we also label the class identified on each bounding box. Now it's time to see the demo in action. I'll play the video. We can see the object detection at work. We are able to detect a motorbike, a car, a person, and a potted plant here. For any questions in this demo and the toolkit in general, please visit Qualcomm Developer Network.